There are times when you want to expose your local service temporary to the outside world. For example, you might be developing a payment integration with Stripe or Lemon Squeezy and you want to test the webhooks and they're sent to your local development server because you don't want to deploy it for each code change that you make and you test and for all the different webhooks. Local Tunnel exposes your local host to the world for easy testing and sharing. I think it is great. I've tried so many. I've tried Ngrok and various others. And yes, yeah, some of them worked and some of them didn't. I found them very confusing. What I really liked about Local Tunnel, there was no need to mess with DNS or deploy or anything like that. It just worked out of the box. A few commands and I was up and running and it was brilliant. Let me show you how. So as I said, there are various tools out there, but I really like Local Tunnel. To get started and install it, all you need is Node.js. And you can install Local Tunnel with the npm command npm install g for global local tunnel and you hit enter and it will install it for you and then once that's done to get up and running so on the right you can see i have uh, my project running on localhost 3000 that only works for me like no one else can get to that if i want to share this with a friend to have a look at it to test it have a play with it get feedback they can't i'd have to deploy it well i can run lt so lt for local tunnel and i can say port 3000 and what it's going to do is going to now give me a url that i can use that url to give from my friend, use on my phone, whatever I want to do, and it will route it through to my local host on 3000. So make sure you do have your app running. You can see I have it running on this terminal at the bottom left.